what happens after you click buy on your Amazon purchase. 14 miles of conveyor belts help sort and package products with the help of a part robot, part human team. Our systems know exactly which item to pick and how quickly to get it to you. And that's what we do next. We travel on our over 14 miles of conveyors up through our pack stations and then our packages are all sorted uh, by customer, by ship destination, out to you. The 1.2 million square foot fulfillment center in Robbinsville is a maze of brightly colored sorting buckets and shelves. More than 2,500 employees have been hired since it unofficially opened last July. The goals are actually uh, above where we believe we'd be at this point. It's called an eighth generation facility because of the advanced technology. Bright orange robots, Amazon refers to them as NFL linemen, lift up to 750 pounds. They make our associates more efficient. They actually do the walk for our associates. They bring the shelves to them, take the shelves away, and uh, really our associates love interacting with them. We wanted to get uh, young men and women from the, uh, the inner city of Trenton, give them an easier opportunity to come out here and get jobs, which they have. Uh, they can take one bus uh, from the city of Trenton, then we have a dedicated C line that comes right out here to the corporate center, which is free and they can just hop on, hop off. Amazon is notoriously known for its secrecy, but today officials divulged on their efficiency. And you can see the items as you look down, multiple items. You could have a phone case uh, next to a book, next to a slinky. And the reason we still receive them randomly is because we stow them randomly. You never know what, cu what a customer is going to order. It takes a small army of both employees and computers to process and sort the items because fulfillment centers like this are shipping packages 24 hours a day. We can hit about 40% of the nation within a 10-hour car or truck drive, so it's a great location to move product. Companies go to states for two reasons. First, the numbers have to work. In this case, you know, there were no state tax incentives involved in this program, but the numbers worked in a different way. Amazon will also expand to Carteret, opening a center there with about 800 employees. And as they reminded everyone today, yes, they're hiring. In Robbinsville, I'm Brianna Venosi, NJTV News.